Um, all right, next one up, I'd like to bring up Jesse Moriarty! Well, you may have noticed that uh, everyone else has been jocular, ribbing at best, or ended on a friendly note. <laughs> I have a theory that Enrique is currently wearing an outfit festooned with bells for a reason similar to why sex offenders have to introduce themselves <laughs> in the neighborhood that they move in. When I first heard, this multitude of faults are glaringly obvious to anyone, even the most casual observer. As Nate pointed out earlier, Enrique is in fact the greatest argument against Charles Darwin's theory of natural selection. And yet, paradoxically, his existence also disproves the notion of a loving God. <laughs> suggests he was created as a biological weapon <laughs> and subsequently outlawed by the Geneva Convention. <laughs> Whatever the case, I felt that there was nothing I could say about him that someone downwind of him could not grasp more effectively. <laughs> but, on reflection, I realized we did have many things in common, sharing a love of comics, first and foremost, and I had, in fact, illegally read most of the comics in his store. <laughs> and so perhaps I owed him something. <laughs> and so, in tribute to the way Enrique has lived his life up to this point, I decided to put the least amount of possible effort <laughs> in the creation of this speech. <laughs> to this end, I have simply copied and pasted part of the Wikipedia article on Batman. <laughs> and use the find and replace function on my computer to change all instances of the name Bruce Wayne to Enrique Munoz, and to change all instances of his superhero alias Batman to Shitbeard the Pirate. <laughs> stories tend to portray Enrique Munoz as the character's facade and Shitbeard the Pirate as the truer representation of his personality, in counterpoint to the post-crisis Superman whose Clark Kent persona is the real personality and Superman is the mask. In Shitbeard the Pirate Unmasked, a television documentary about the psychology of his character, associate professor of social psychology at the University of California, Los Angeles, and an adjunct behavioral scientist at the RAND Corporation, Benjamin Kamey, notes that Shitbeard the Pirate's personality is driven by Enrique Munoz's inherent humanity. That Shitbeard the Pirate, for all its benefits, and for all the time Enrique Munoz devotes to it, is ultimately a tool for Enrique Munoz's efforts to make the world better. Thank you, Enrique.